hello viewers what's up today i will start working with this panels you see we need one two three and four panels so open your net means before that go to file and close and then right click it go to events action action perform and then you see you need to remove the slash and then again go to design and now we are working with the panels take a panel and put it here and resize it I think it's better for this panel and go to properties change the border I am selecting this one ok close take another panel and put it here and then resize it and go to properties and then border I am selecting tiled border and for this one I am selecting this and title will be student info and color for color I'm selecting this one and then for font I'm selecting agency FB and font size 14 and bold okay okay then close oh we need to make it center then go to properties and then border and the position not the position justification center okay then close it now we need another two panels go to properties and then go to border and select this one ok close and this is the new panel again go to properties then border and select this one ok close so let's go to the source and then run the program you see we have chosen four panels now I am going to create this table so for doing this go to design go to palette and take a table and you see the table is too larger for the panel and if we put it here then our design entire design will be changed so we cannot do this so press ctrl plus z for undo it ctrl z and what can we do actually right now i don't have a very good solution but i have one go to source package and right click it new j frame form finish and then i'm going to put my table here here is the table and then i'm going to resize it and then put it here and make the window smaller and then I'm going to cut the table 
then I'm going to paste it here and then I will resize the panel and then the table and now I'm going to delete the new J frame from delete ok and then go to source and run the program you see I have taken a table from our palette so again go to design then click the panel and go to properties and go to background for the background color of the panel I'm selecting this one and close and you know for showing the values from the database into a table you know what to do at first I'm going to rename the table name right click and go to change variable name I'm changing my table name to table table student short info and hit enter and then go to source and you see we need to create a method and then we need to call it at first copy this method and then paste it and I'm going to rename the method to update is to dent short info and for this table I'm going to select only student ID and first name so we need not write the other entities only student id and first name and i will set the information into table student short info and then i need to call this method let's copy it and i will paste it here So let's run our program and you see the values from our database are shown in this table and I have inserted a several data already and you see this is our table and this are, there are six rows. you can change the font of your table then go to properties and here the option I'm going to make it bold and I'm selecting 14 ok close and then again go to source and run the file Large. again right click the table then go to properties and font and I'm going to make it 12 close and go to source and run the file I think it's better but we need to I think make the color slightly lighter it will look nice color of the background of this panel then go to, to panel properties and for background color I am selecting this one ok close then go to source and run the file again hmm. now it's looking good so for today that's it
please don't forget to subscribe thank you very much for watching